Hey, what's up, everybody? I am truly and utterly exhausted from the week. And the thing is, tomorrow and the next day, I'm going to be flea marketing. So let's see if I can maximize my sleep. And hopefully I don't oversleep, you know. It's been a good week. I mean, I, I'm tired, yes, but it's been a very, very good week. I've made the most of my time this week. And I have a new project. But before I get into that, uh, I'm going to congratulate Chris Paul and the Suns for advancing. I'm a big fan of the Suns now. After watching Chris Paul have a perfect, freaking perfect game. He went 14 for 14. And I'm not talking layups. I I'm talking mid-range. It's just a, a thing of beauty. I would say Chris Paul is the mid-range king. They call him the point god. I will call him the mid-range god. His mid-range game is freaking, freaking amazing. But yeah, back to uh, back to this. Uh, this this week, uh, just about every day, I've spent in a salvage yard. And flea marketing is a really interesting experience. But salvage yarding is also a really ex it's 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 inter interesting experience. Now you can tell how sleepy I am. It's an interesting experience, and I found a hidden gem. Lots of hidden gems. And I will get into that. Uh, well, I'll get into it a little bit. Give you a little bit of a preview of what I've got planned. I know I shouldn't start any new series because I'm, hell, I'm very, very far behind on my premium series. The one series that I love, and I love to do, which is comment of the week. But I will be doing Salvage Yard Stories coming sometime this year. Maybe like in a month. I'm not sure. I might record them now and upload them a little bit later. Uh, you know, I'm not sure if that's going to be a, a constant series like Flea Marketing. But I'm on this quest to basically restore a 1994 Nissan Sentra. And it's very hard because it's not like a Civic or a Corolla. The Sentra, even though... I, I personally think there are certain things about the Sentra that's very special. Uh, Scotty Kilmer, he likes his 94 Celica. But in these salvage yard stories, I will go over uh, my salvage yarding and what I found to help me restore and bring this 94 Sentra back to its glory. Now you might say, Rick, glory, 94 Sentra? I will explain to all of you all the great things about a 94 Sentra. Some of you that have had 91 through 94 Sentras, you know what I'm talking about. It's a very, very, very special vehicle. Very underrated. And I'm doing my best. I'm inspired now to go through the process of actually restoring, uh, rebuilding, retooling, and making one of the nicest 94 Sentras on God's green earth. That's a goal. It's going to be a passion going forward. So, yeah. Hope you're excited about this. If you're not, I, I don't really care because I'm excited about it. And uh, show off Saturday tomorrow might be a jump start actually on that. I'm not sure I'm going to do for show off uh, Saturday tomorrow. Not planned. We don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. Um, uh, what else? I didn't catch the Grizzlies Memphis game. Who won that one? I mean, I could look it up, but God, I'm just so fucking exhausted. <laughs> 